greetings. Oh, that's news podcast is in the machine. I've got a bonus episode for you guys on something that was on my mind a little bit ago and has been for the last few days that a album that I listened to on Black Mile Promotion on the YouTube channel. Caught my eye, found it quite a bit of interest in it, and it happened to have a really good sound to it. So I found the genre that it was listed as to be interesting that it just so happened to have matched with the project that I was working on at the time. So, with it, be, with it being black metal, with the little electronic stuff added in, it was defined as Black Wave. So, I uploaded the project when it was finished. Real under the name. Still is. It's going to stay as it stands right now. It's going to stay how it is. <clears throat> and I wrote that under the name Black Wave. So experimental. Electronic, black, black metal, black and parentheses, black wave. Now, I'm prompt, I'm prompted with this because not only is all of the content I'm making currently right now doing poorly compared to how it was doing 10 years ago. Mostly, I'm, I'm, I'm told by the viewers, and also other people that know me, that it isn't positive stuff or reggae stuff or stuff, things that I used to be into at, at a time. The confusion is not what I'm here, cleaning up the confusion is not what I'm I'm here to talk about today. I simply want to realign myself and get centered here and find the way uh, that I can set the framework for me to be able to actually talk about what, just to put it frankly, just what and how it was black way. Like, oh, that sounds cool. Oh, I'm making stuff that sounds similar or would fit into that. The reason for me getting sidetracked as well is uh, I need some ac- I need I need some some way to actually really define this you know what it would have I would have really defined this so experimental black metal for now is how it stands I'll have to later on go in remove black wave remove experimental electronic black metal just leave it as experimental black metal for now under that project same project name different already published already uploaded to the to youtube uh album and so that's what i'm going to be talking about here but on a different note this is a new season the first bonus episode of this season and accordingly the theme song has changed the interlude music has changed, and I'm doing entirely all self-promoting until I get in, in contact with a few companies that would both of us would be interested in working together on. So, for bonus episode one, season four, we call for doing podcasts. So, hope you guys enjoy this ramble from this rambler. Metal News! Metal Music! Metal Podcast!
the occasional mythos. And constant chaos. Prayer is the best way to know God. Not listening to. Podcast is the quickest, but there is no God. Hello. Welcome to this bonus episode of the Vault of Doom podcast. I feel certainly had a couple things on, on my mind, so I have to do a quick bonus episode for really, really more for myself, really. So getting that. Getting that published as the bonus episode will be one of those things where while I'm recording the episode and thinking about it and talking about it, I'm saying to myself, well then, is it going to screw with the actual number of episodes that I actually have out? Like, the answer, the answer, the answer is no. Bonus episodes do not count toward the actual number of episodes for the show, so with this being a bonus episode, I won't have to worry about it interfering with the uh, following episode of of Hail Satan. I'm recording this on a Saturday, Seder's Day. And have a couple things specifically about defining the musical genre and feelings adequate in the work ethic. It's not that I don't feel as though I'm working hard enough. It's not even that I feel as though I'm working too hard or paying too much attention to my own work ethic. It's just a matter of that the working and then not having from a journalistic, a journalism perspective. Not having the, the news remain current the same way that a grocery store needs their products to remain fresh. So luckily for everybody else that does this same thing, there's a bonus episodes published for that same exact reason that I, I have uh, to yammer and give myself the old chin wag. I knew a guy that had like a mustache and he kind of talked like this. But I don't have a mustache. So, actually I do technically have a mustache. I would just rather let the guy with the mustache have his unique personality and character. The, and the stuff that he would say would be like Oh, I'm, I'm quoting Frederick Nietzsche, or you know, I'm, th- I'm just talking about like something Lewis Carroll-esque and, and Alice in Wonderland style. I have to excuse the wind blowing. Uh, anyway, so th- this episode about the defining musical genres. Now I have to, I have to do my research on this, I have to do my my serious research and just kind of find out, because in my mind and in my head I think the the person, all the genres, the way that each genre is defined and the bands that make the genre, that it just naturally falls in that way. I'm sure it might be that way for some, but currently I'm stuck with the dilemma of that I heard some music under a genre, was inspired by it, 
made some stuff that was unique to my stuff, performing my duty and responsibility as an artist, and then later on listening to somebody who had a better idea than me, sort of thing. Kind of like the uh, white picket fence in the American town where you have a brand new lawnmower or a brand new this, and then you look at the neighbor and he has you know, like a better one, and you look over there and you say that. Uh, that's a good, nice freaking uh, power washer you got there. And I need to step my game. I, I, I could try to lie to myself all I want, but that is what it is. I feel like I should have said the genre was this, but editing the video is not going to change it. And doing the research, nothing's really actually going to change it. Just kind of spending the time here right now with that... I need to do that, that I need to do that and look into it is, is one thing. So finding a forum I'm sure would also help if it wasn't such a madhouse and such such a chaos to go into a forum, find people chatting, talking about a topic, and then trying to get involved in the conversation, the next thing you know. The, 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 the things that people say are just so out there. I can't, I can't even, can't even fight the amount of time that's wasted from sitting there in confusion of uh, whatever we were speaking about in the, in the forum. So now if I'm supposed if I'm to do some kind of research, first of all, I'm gonna have to contrast it to the research that I usually do on this specific topic. Defining musical genre. That if you Google it, you get the basic you get the basic gist. You can get the basic idea. And me being a specializer who specializes in whatever he so chooses to specialize on has a bit of a compared judgment my, my judgment's just a bit hazy foggy and clouded from having a specific stuff that I'm working on right now but looking into it I'm not gonna get the answer from Google I'm not gonna get the answer from a forum and you, you reach the point where when you seek, find some, somebody finds you seeking this kind of thing out, like a company or business that right, makes money from this sort of thing, you, they're licking their chops because you've now become prey. And that's what I'm at risk. What I run, I, that's what I have to run the risk of becoming is. Oh, sure, we will accurately tell you what genre you are for five payments of five ninety nine, And you've reached that point where it's the same thing as the forum. So it started with one thing. It ends when I start explaining. I know that much, so... Anybody who could try to have any kind of explanation or ask about an explanation or sitting comfortably behind a computer and thinking to themselves lots of multitudes of things like ah, this is just like I'm uh, me in my head while watching this or I'm super... I, I couldn't possibly have this this large of an understanding. I, I'm not an, the smartest person, but I'm not a dummy. So having the multitudes of, of storm-like thoughts just clouding my head, well, I'm, I'm just yet again, one, once again, another statistic and another person to just go ahead and get in line where where you have a long line of people waiting in line for their healing and and this and that. So it's the end it is the end of days. Welcome to welcome to the end of days. This is the apocalypse.
Uh, anyway, for the most part, it's that's that's uh, you know falling. But technically, that's a falling prey to certain stuff, and then this would be the shift of uh, like, oh, so I've been a predator the whole time, or something like that, where I could say, uh, you know, technically, I'm not supposed to speak on any of this stuff unless I have some sort of representation, or or whatever, or have any kind of interest in backing it up or spending enough time. And and yet, a guy like me, a person like me, seems to always slip through the cracks. So I don't have any idea what uh, what other interest I would have other than just talking about the stuff that comes natural to me. So I I've spe- I've specifically typed in a genre. It's just a reiteration again. Her genre. Was inspired by it. Made one that was like it. Uh, wrote that. Type to town. Write it down. Type to town. And then. Uh, better version. Came. To my attention. And then I said. Well. Then maybe. Uh, that's where the. That's where the battlefield is at right now. That The battlefield is at. That I. I'm I'm not going to change it. It is a more accurate, so it becomes that's where that battle concludes. Where I have to say to myself, it it is more accurate that I say, but I'll have to I'll have to edit the the, the uh, it's in the title, not the description, but it might be in the title and the description. And I delete what I have, rewrite what it is best. And then, you know, the timing being, the timing being the issue that, uh, uh, what, what I'm dealing with then is somebody can, like the source of the information, the source of where I got the information can say they have a power over me, they have a ha- upper hand over me, or something like that. And it's it's not it's not cool. It's not okay. It's so over with. Everybody's over over it. Everybody's over that kind of that kind of thing. At least in terms of constantly needing to fight over this sort of thing. It's very real, but it's also very over with. Everybody's very very much over it. But it's certainly very real that I. I listen to this genre, different source. I am the source of what matters to me the most. It just does not seem to matter to anybody very much. But what I should be, could be talking about is the analytics of how this one did to the traditional black metal. Which has more views than the other one. So the 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 but I can't since I can't I have to kind of work through, power through, go over and over again this battle of different source. So I caught, caught the idea of calling it this specific name. Listen to it because I listened to it and I liked it. I hear another name for a different one later. Or the same thing, but who's who's got, some, some, who's not there? Somebody's got to be telling me is what what is the accuracy here? What is the what 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 is it authentic? What is the genuinely? What is it really actually? What can how can I actually clearly define it uh, with it? Ultimately, even not even being that serious, as I simply can, can really, I can only use this at some party or dinner party later, or I'm explaining and discussing it over with other people, even if I needed to use that kind of authenticity for my own content, I, I'm not going to run over and beat it into the ground that much to say, it's this, 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 or this, you know, just repeating the same, same genre over and over again 
but I'm I'm perfectly capable of handling this situation on my hands so I'm going to and it starts with discussing it it starts with a discussion that's what this is and uh fortunately it also has to officially start when this this message has been uh completed so the me basically getting ready to start doing that beating into the ground aspect of it I'm cutting out and that is uh, this has been I, I am Mickey Gemini this has been Vault of Doom podcast episode bonus episode one of the fourth season uh, glad that you have been enjoying hearing me ranting about whether I have I have d- clearly defined, correctly defined the the musical genre that of one of the experimentals as it matters right now and I will at no 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 other time other than right now. All right, bouncing out.